Our security architecture personnel here present, the chief of defense staff, the chief of the air staff, the chief of naval staff, the inspector general of police, and the chief of army staff. Our distinguished awardees, heads of MDAs here present, specific mention, the permanent secretaries here present, with specific mention to the permanent secretary, special duties and intergovernmental affairs, Nigeria Roberts, secretary of the 2022 National Honors Award Investor, captains of industry here present, members of the international organizations who warrants the Nigerian order of dignity and honor, deserving citizens, friends of Nigeria, who have contributed to the development and progress of the country in various fields of human endeavor. The act took a retrospective effect from the 1st of October, 1963. The act is considered and seen in two categories the category of the Order of the Federal Republic and the category of the Order of the Niger. We also have the medallion category. On the category of the Order of the Federal Republic, we have the Order Number no. 1, the Grand Commander of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, the Grand Commander of the Order of the Federal Republic, that only belongs to the sitting presidents and other presidents of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The second, is the Grand Commander of the Order of the Niger, which is the Vice Presidents and uh, Chief Justices, as well as other distinguished panel. We also have the Commander of the Order of the Federal Republic, the Officer of the Order, and then a member of the Order of the Republic. And on the Order of the Niger, we have the GCON, the CON, the OON, and the MON. And on the medallion stage, we'll have the Federal Republic Medal First Class and Federal Republic Medal Second Class. Thank you, Yusuf. I'd like to celebrate all the governors who have joined us today, their excellencies. Please let's give them a round of applause for joining us this morning. Their excellencies, governors from across the country, we welcome you. Thank you for coming. In whichever capacity, issue is selfless service to father and motherland, and its recognition stands out. Your Excellency, Mr. President, our deeds are known to serve as model for emulation. And talking about emulation, let me very quickly introduce a man who is certainly worthy of emulation. For only a man of outstanding accomplishments and recognition will organize and coordinate an event to confer national honors on others, an award he himself has not received. This morning, it pleases me to invite a selfless public servant and sterling administrator, Senator Dr. George Akumea, Honorable Minister, 
special duties and intergovernmental affairs to deliver the official welcome address. The President and Commander in Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Excellency Muhammad Buhari, Vice President, Excellency Professor Demi Ostebanjo, SAKCOM, all protocol duly respected. I feel greatly honored and delighted to welcome the President and Commander-in-Chief, Federal Republic of Nigeria, His Excellency Muhammad Buhari, the Vice President Professor Yemi Osibanjo, and all the awardees and our esteemed invited guests, the 2022 National Honors Award, Investigator Ceremony. Excellency, Mr. President, you may be seated. Thank you very much. Your Excellency, Mr. President, we begin the official proceedings of the 2022 National Honors Award Investiture. And we start with the Grand Commander of the Order of the Niger. I'd like to start straight away by uh, talking about a gentleman who will lead these elections, Excellency Senator Ahmed Ibrahim Lau, the Senate President. He will be upstanding for a few seconds. He began his career as education officer and rose to become a lecturer at the University of New York. Thereafter, he joined politics, a seasoned educator, erudite scholar, experienced legislator, 20 years in service. He was at the House of Representatives and then went on to the Senate. Distinguished Senator Lau is being given the award in recognition of his contributions to the National Senate and for improving the relationship between the executive and the legislature. Mr. President, we present to you distinguished Senator Ahmed Dow, Senate President, for the conferment of the national honors of the Grand Commander of the Order of Nigeria.
Mr. President, sir, we bring before you Honorable Justice Ibrahim Mohammed Campo. Justice Brian Mohammed Campo, the immediate past Chief Justice of Nigeria, attended Ahmed Bello University, Zaria, where he studied Islamic law, had a master's degree and PhD at the same university. He began his career as a chief magistrate and rose to becoming the Chief Justice of Nigeria on the 26th of June, 2022. Justice Brian Mohammed Campo voluntarily resigned as Chief Justice, citing Neil Howard, in view of his contributions to the judiciary and his patriotism, Mr. President, we present to you Honorable Justice Brian Tanko for the performance of the award for the Grand Commander of the Order of the Niger.
Sindani Mohammed Andi. Professor Bandi has been an outstanding career, has had an outstanding career as a scholar and diplomat. He received his political science degree from the Amadou Bello University, in Nigeria, and an M in political science from the Boston University, United States of America, and a PhD in political science from the University of Toronto, Canada, in 1987. Professor Bandi started his teaching career at the Usman and Folio University of Sokoto, Nigeria in 1980, rising to the rank of professor and ultimately vice chancellor between the years 2004 and 2009. From 2010 to 2016, Professor Mohammed Muhammad Bandi held the position of Director General of the National Institute for Policy and Strategic Studies, Nigeria's most reputable policy institution for training leaders from the public and private sectors. Professor Bande has been an assessor for the National Merit Award of Nigeria. He has won many mer mer merit awards and honors from institutions and government in Nigeria and beyond. Most notably, he is a recipient of Nigeria's Officer of the Order of the Federal Republic, OFR, in recognition of his contribution to policy development and implementation Quality representation of Nigeria at international forum. Tidani Mohammed Bande is being conferred with the National Honors Award Grand Commander of the Order of the Niger GCOM. Commander of the Federal Republic, CFR. 
Oluwa roti mi odunayo akere dondu S-A-N Abubaka Atiku Bagudu Engineer David Mweze Umahi Right Honorable Lawrence Zifani Uwani Right Honorable Simon Bako Lalong Right Honorable Ahmed Idris Wase Alhaji Kaimala Buni Oluwa Rotimi Odwayo Akere Dolu S.A.M. Oluwa Rotimi Odwayo Akere Dolu S.A.M. Engineer David Mweze Umani. Right Honorable Lawrence Ifani Ugwani. Madam Nasser Ahmed Al Rufai, not here. Senator Dr. Ifan Yujuku Arthur Ogawa. Vice President, our next Vice President. Professor Babagana Zulu. Exactly. Mohammed 
Rosa Rello. Jimmy Bristol. Senator Yaya Abu Bakar Abdullahi, I hope you understand by please. Abu Bakar Malami S A N. Distinguished Senator Solomon Olamilekon mm -hmm. Adiola. Mm -hmm. uh, the budget should uh, be on uh, Senator Musa Mohamed Sani, Senator Michael Okwai Mibamidele, Senator Chupu at uh, Portfield Tazi, Senator Barrow Ibrahim Jibril, and Senator Tulu Lope. We call on Senator Walker Carey.